The first suspect is a Hickory resident who was arrested yesterday and charged with being on premises illegally. He was placed in the Catawba County Detention Facility following his arrest and was scheduled to appear in court today. 29-year-old Carl Dean Shook of Ricker Road in Hickory was arrested yesterday by Catawba County Sheriff's officers. He's charged with sex offender unlawfully on premises and misdemeanor larceny. Shook was jailed in the Catawba County Detention Facility under $25,500 bond. A superior court appearance was scheduled today. A district court date is set for November 1st. 40-year-old Brandon Earl Little of 18th Avenue Northeast in Hickory was arrested Sunday by Hickory police officers. He's charged with felony possession of heroin and misdemeanor possession of drug paraphernalia. Following the arrest, Little was jailed in the Catawba County Detention Facility under $5,000 bond. His next district court appearance is scheduled for November 8th. The next suspect is an Alexander County resident charged in Catawba County with drug offenses. 38-year-old Holly Ann Kaiser of Berea Church Quincy Road in Hiddenite was arrested yesterday by Hickory Police. She's charged with possession of methamphetamine and possession of drug paraphernalia. Kaiser was incarcerated in the Catawba County Detention Facility in Newton under $2,000 bond. A district court date was scheduled yesterday. 38-year-old Christopher Scott Travis of 22nd Street Southeast in Hickory was arrested today by Conover police officers. He's charged with felony forgery of an endorsement. Following this morning's arrest, Travis was incarcerated in the Catawba County Detention Facility under $1,200 bond. A district court appearance is scheduled for November 17th. Reporting for WHKY-TV News, I'm Rob Eastwood.